Hey, you guys. Welcome back to Married to Film. Listen, here's part two. Oh, Lord. They're about to kill you for real now. When you're telling you best, it's a thing. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Is that what you think this is? Hmm? You being stubborn? Fine. Hard headed. You need to tell me the truth. I've never lied to you. Never, Leah. I'm not gonna start now. Let's try this again. Ah! We waterboarding again? What do you know about those people? I don't know shit. I'd help you if I could. You know I would. Just give me a dog. Let me go. You You'll never see me again. You don't want to go with you. Do what you want. Oh, Lord, and I'm beating him up. Oh. Whoa. What is it? He's down the truth. Oh, bossy. Turner. Where the heck we at? I have no idea. Is this a police station? It's an old county jail. <laughs> <laughs> I tried. I couldn't save him. I tried. Okay, son, you did the right thing. You brought him home. Okay, there's some crazy stuff right here, Angela Kane. What? Uh-uh. What was that? <laughs> Come on, like Walter White. That's nice weird. you through the screen. Uh-oh. Uh One of my brothers is dead. Michael Turner was his name. We fought all over the world together. Hope brought him in after her last tour when he started his company. I thought you were soldiers. We were. Then we went private. You didn't tell me you were Mark. Mm, what does it matter? It was the same damn job. So we could actually pay our bills. Michael was like me and that he didn't have a family. He was a little brother I never had. You know, the little brother I always wanted. And he's dead. And she looks yeah, like lost a lot of people. Sorry. Here, you know, that's been hard. <sighs> Not like this. This is the first time I lost someone close to me a long time. So maybe for you. Oh. Yeah, I can't tell. Right, that's what I was asking. I came back and you were gone. She told you not to leave. You left me. Mm -hmm. Okay, here we go. I asked you what you wanted. Oh, uh, what? You left. You had to go finish with the book. scared. Of what? Let it go. Uh, can you let me out this cage, though? Right. It doesn't matter. 
We went and worked anyway. Couldn't have been happy. Not in a world like this. Is that you talking or your family? Uh -huh. Like you've never done things. Killed people. Uh. I know the things you've done. So you have no right to judge. Not at all. This is me, Daryl. The good and the bad. Oh, okay. All of it and always has been. Oh, okay. I don't believe you. Well, I can't help with that. But I can't help you save yourself. Because despite everything, I still care about you. And I don't want anything bad to happen to you. Can I get dog to go home and do it? Right. So you need to tell me something. Uh, 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 uh. Anything. Because if you can't, I can't control my commander and what he will do next. Commander. He's angry about Turner. And he wants someone to pay. There's a woman. She's the leader. And they were speaking in code because I was an outsider. He's a tall, skinny guy. Never shuts up. Naked. And a priest who carries a shotgun. That's their leadership? Yeah. But they have the numbers. One of their soldiers slipped up and he was going to go meet three dozen of their fighters. That's way more than the 15 you got here. <sighs> You've been doing your work down here, huh? <laughs> oh, they don't kill him. Yeah. I'll have you moved out of here tonight. So you can be more comfortable. What? More comfortable? I, you know what? I can't stand these people when I come. You know what I mean? It's Pope. No, you don't. What if he was speaking Latin? Well, oh, you were right. He was hard to break. He told me there were a lot more out there than we thought. More than twice the force we have in here. I think he'll be good here. Mm -hmm. And we need the manpower. Turner Vaughn and Nichols and Montagna are still missing. Say something. You know I hate it when you do this. Do what? Freeze me out. Not everything is about you, Leah. I never said it was. No, no. Because here we are, losing the day, attracting our enemy. Because you, you had to go on a fishing expedition with an old boyfriend. Go on then. Tell me. You find what you're looking for. I told you he would be useful and I was right. He's a lot like us. Pain doesn't scare him. Death doesn't scare him. Carver saw it. Come on, you see it. I just see a guy who wants to get in your pants. Fine. I see you gotta wanna go home. Fine. Couldn't stop gazing on somebody he loved. I never said he loved me. Oh. <laughs> you could have handed him out there today, and he didn't. At one point, he meant something to me, yeah. I've been open about that. But it ended the day you found me, and I chose this family, and I have never once regretted that decision, and I don't want you to either. Do you? I believe in you. More than the others. Uh. I know. <laughs> you think we can trust him? Yeah. Good. Now let me see for myself. It's not gonna be good. You got something to say? Come on, man. Don't be shy. You're about to meet the man. Yeah, say that coy shit for your girlfriend. Oh, Sean, nobody's girlfriend. Hey, wake up!